In a small town, surrounded by rolling hills, lived a curious boy named Gabriel. Gabriel had a wild imagination and a knack for finding adventure in the most unexpected places. One sunny morning, while exploring the lush garden behind his house, Gabriel stumbled upon a peculiar sight, a tiny frog wearing a chef's hat. The frog introduced himself as Brian, an aspiring chef who traveled the world to learn new cooking techniques and ingredients. Brian explained that he was on a quest to become the greatest chef in the animal kingdom, but he needed a human partner to help him with some wacky cooking challenges. Gabriel, always up for an adventure, eagerly agreed to join Brian on his culinary journey. Their first stop was a bustling marketplace in a distant land, where the air was filled with the aroma of exotic spices and sizzling street food. Gabriel and Brian marveled at the vibrant stalls, each offering a unique array of ingredients. As they wandered through the market, they encountered a peculiar challenge, a cooking contest judged by a panel of very picky chickens. The task was to create a dish using only the ingredients found in a mystery basket. Gabriel and Brian opened their basket to find a bewildering assortment of items, including durian, pickles, and marshmallows. Gabriel scratched his head, unsure of how to combine such unusual ingredients. But Brian, with a twinkle in his eye, had an idea. Why not make a durian pickle marshmallow pie? He suggested. Gabriel giggled at the absurdity but decided to give it a try. As they mixed and mashed, the chickens watched with skeptical eyes. The pie was a strange concoction of sweet, sour, and pungent flavors, but Gabriel and Brian presented it with flair. The chickens pecked at the pie cautiously, and to everyone's surprise, they clucked with delight. With their confidence boosted, Gabriel and Brian continued their journey, traveling to a snowy mountaintop where they faced their next challenge, cooking in freezing temperatures. They had to prepare a warm soup using snowflakes and icicles as ingredients. Gabriel shivered as he stirred the icy pot, while Brian hopped around to keep warm. Despite the cold, they managed to create a steaming bowl of soup that melted hearts and warmed souls. The local penguins, who were the judges this time, waddled over and gave their flippers of approval. Their final destination was a tropical island, where they encountered their toughest challenge yet, cooking a dish that could impress the island's king, a very picky parrot. The king demanded a dish that was both colorful and delicious, using only the fruits and flowers of the island. Gabriel and Brian brainstormed, picking the juiciest fruits and the most vibrant flowers. They decided to make a rainbow fruit salad, arranging the fruits in a dazzling display of colors and garnishing it with edible flower petals. The king parrot, with his keen eye for beauty, was thoroughly impressed. As the sun set over the island, Gabriel and Brian celebrated their culinary triumphs. They had faced wacky challenges and unusual dishes, but through teamwork and humor, they had succeeded. With a heartfelt goodbye, Brian thanked Gabriel for being a wonderful partner and promised to visit again. Returning home, Gabriel felt a sense of accomplishment and joy. He had learned that with creativity and a little laughter, even the strangest challenges could be overcome. And as he drifted off to sleep, he dreamed of more adventures with his froggy friend, Brian the chef. And so, in their small town surrounded by rolling hills, Gabriel and Brian's story became a legend, inspiring others to embrace the unexpected and find joy in the journey.